Hey Dave, come here quick, there's something you gotta see. That man has got a dancing bear tied up to that old tree. And it's dance, dance, Dakota dance, all around the country store. Me and sweet Betty ain't never seen a bear that can dance before. Well, it's a one step, two step, three step, four. Follow Dakota and it dance some more. What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, the Mac of All Trades. And it's Monday, October 9th, I want to say. Um, We killed it yesterday on some Instacart. I'm over here waiting for some orders to pop up here in Lawrence at 6th um, and Wakarusa. But you guys, um, we'll see how well I do today because I'm not feeling the best. So uh, it's not like I'm sick or anything. But, you know, um, some people call it ant flow, ant flow, um, visiting. So I prefer to call it the communists have invaded my body because my body has become a communist country because the communists have invaded my body. So, um, yeah, it's like North Korea up in here. We'll see how well I do today because, um, it seems like as I get older, like the worse it gets you know what i mean like i remember when i was young i could do whatever when it was that time but now i'm just like you know like and plus when you're an instacart shopper or a driver or doing delivery things like that um it's hard when you know the communists are in town because you gotta be on top of that so it makes it difficult, you guys. So, um, who's with me? And do it and comment down below if you have any weird names for for that. Because I've like heard and flow, but um I think I'm the only person that um considers when you know it's that time of the month, I call it the communist. My daughter calls it Shark Week. <laughs> um so <laughs> Yeah, comment down below what you refer to your time of the month as because I'm really curious as to what other people refer to it as if they have like a funny nickname or anything like that. But we'll see what orders we can get today, you guys, because I'm just not, you know, it just puts you in a mood. I'm not feeling it. Maybe I've never done the my doll thing, so maybe I'll get some because I heard that my doll is amazing. I don't think I've ever used it so i might try it and see how it, if it makes me have more energy and stuff like that but um yeah we'll see if we can grab any orders today if not we might do some grocery shopping or something like that and then go home and try to get some things done at home i still got to finish cleaning i wasn't able to get all that done yesterday so we'll see what we can accomplish today it's hard to accomplish anything when your body is North Korea because they just taking control. Okay, y'all. So, uh, story time real quick. But I was leaving the Walmart over on Congressional in Lawrence. And there, we have in Lawrence, there's a large um, homeless population here. Um, they have a camp over on the other side of the river at North Lawrence, like along the river where they just have tents and everything set up um <clears throat> and they live there but anyway so this girl or woman has a sign that says homeless please help and it's standing on the corner and i had my windows cracked and as i'm driving up to the stop sign she's standing at she goes like this to me and i go no sorry and she goes you drive a Benz though and I just kind of looked at her and my new thing is now when like there's road rage or something of that nature I make the dumbest face I can possibly think of in the moment and I stick my tongue out so I was like this Like, that's my new thing. It pisses people off, but I think it's funny. But you guys, like, just because I'm driving this car doesn't mean I got money to give to you. I'm out here hustling my ass off. 
trying to make a buck and you want me to give you that buck because you don't want to hustle your ass off. So you guys, like there's only one guy that I have ever given money to here in Lawrence and I call him the Orange Hulk Hogan because he is always wearing all orange and the way his hair looks, he, he, and he wears this bandana and it kind of reminds me of Hulk Hogan. But the reason why I give him money is because his sign is Honest AF and I'm supporting his mission because his sign says, not gonna lie, just need weed. So I'm like, yes, dude, you're being honest. I'm giving you some money. <laughs> so, you know what I mean? I'm like, I support your mission. Like, dude, don't we all? But <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, how rude, like just because I'm in this car, you think that I should give you money? And not only that, but you're gonna do this to me? Girl, get out of here. So while I was out, you guys, I stopped in at Kroger slash Dylan's and they had these trash bags on clearance for only $4.75. I picked up two boxes, plus there's extra points on fetch for these, but they had other trash bags on clearance. I'll insert some pictures of the other ones that they had, but you guys, it's an amazing deal. Um, just wanted to share it with you guys. So yeah, go get you some trash bags for hella hella cheap, y'all. I also stopped at Aldi's and picked up two pumpkins. These are huge pumpkins. They were only $3.89 each. So, yeah, you guys, much cheaper than going to the pumpkin patch. I know it's fun going to the pumpkin patch, but these are only $3.89 a piece at Aldi's. Spooky. Bring the boo ball back. No. No toys outside. Come here. Can I have the boo ball? I know you're trying to hide it from DOG. No, give me the boo ball. We don't bring the boo ball outside. Boo ball stays inside. I'm sorry. No. <laughs> no. Boo ball stays inside. <laughs> yes. It stays inside. This house is a fucking prison on planet bullshit in the galaxy of this sucks camel dicks. Now he's looking for it. No, boo ball stays inside, you guys. We don't we don't bring toys outside. I know you're trying to hide it. I know you were trying to hide it. But we are not playing hide and go seek. I am so sorry. Are you mad at me? Me and sweet Betty ain't never seen a bear that can dance before. So it's a one step, two step, three step, four. Follow the go to any dance some more. She dance, dance to go to dance all around the country store.